There is a new device in the market that promises to keep you from getting nailed by red light cameras. It doesn't trick the camera or hide your license plate. It merely tells you you're coming up on a red light camera. Jeremy Hohola tested it out this afternoon and is here with what police think about it. Jeremy? 20 Albuquerque intersections have them. Can you remember where all the red light cameras are? This device does it for you, like a digital backseat driver. Every time a red light camera flashes in Albuquerque, the government rakes in at least $69, more if you're caught speeding, too. And that's the sound of your savior from the infamous red light cams. At least that's how it's being pitched to us this afternoon. So it's been available about oh, six months or so. As we drive through the city's red light camera zones with Peter Zeisman of Phantom Alert. We're not saying, you know, break the law. We're not trying to alter your car or your plate or any way. We're just using something that's a really nice high tech piece of safety. It's a common GPS navigation machine, but its brain is loaded with Phantom Alert software that keeps track of every red light camera in Albuquerque and in the rest of the world. When you roll close to a red light cam intersection, it gives out a warning so you can slow down. So there, there, there it goes. Right. Alert red light cameras. So you can set your device to warn you two blocks, three blocks, a half a mile or ten miles if you want to. It's a it was accurate when we rolled up and down Montgomery. <coughs> Albuquerque's red light camera hot zone. We're this coming, is Montgomery right. and San Mateo. <coughs> there it goes. Police say they don't mind it at all. So if this is a alerting the driver that there is a camera up ahead and it actually gets the driver to slow down, um, be aware of the speed limit in that area, and then also be aware of not to run that red light at that intersection, that's a great idea. The database of red light cameras is based on driver input. It can also warn you about speed traps. The cost of the download is about $10 and claims to work with common GPS devices. Back to you, Nicole. Thanks, Jeremy.